Yo, it's RT, and welcome back to another video. This video, we're gonna be on B Twitter. <laughs> Looking at some of Sonic fans' work. We got a Sonic Infinity Engine video. So it looks like we got a nice little green hill zone. Hold on, that quality is not. Yeah, this is clean. You know, I, I know all about Sonic Infinity Engine. I made a video on it two years ago. I, and it's a really nice engine. Son, Sonic does way more than you think he does in his engine. I'm happy that people are making stuff out of this engine. There's a lot of stuff that that have been made with this engine. There's like a there's like a test zone. Sonic the Hedgehog in real life is out now. All right, let's see what this is. Well, this looks cool so far. This looks really nice so far. Looks like Source Filmmaker. This is nice. This is this is nice for it to be low low budget like that. This is this is pretty cool. This is clean. Yeah, this is this is. Yeah, this is pretty cool. I like that. I like that. This one's from Dies in Hog at Sonic Inc. Twenty. I like this. This caught my eye. I like this little art style. It kind of gives me like a stain stained glass type thing. Type R that look, it looks pretty cool. I like it gives me a stained glass vibe. This is really cool. This is really cool. This is really nice. Actually, I'm gonna give that a like. That this is this is clean. I like this. I like this. Here's the tweet. I, I encourage you to go like this. I like this art. It's just really it's really it's really unique. It, it really brings it's really colorful, and it just gives me a nice stained glass vibe. We got some Sonic movie art right here. I knew I saw I saw this coming. I knew someone's gonna do something like this. This is cool. A direct representation of Sonic, Pop, and the cop's wife right here, and the dog. I'm gonna give it a like. I encourage y'all to go give this person a like too. Ray Mystic Nova um, MN Scourge and Sonic Mania Plus. That actually caught my eye. I want to see this. It's cool. This is cool. I they changed the music. This looks cool. Ooh, they got a whole new. That's that's cool. I like that. They even changed the menu and the music for the menu. Yeah, it looks like he's just the same function, functioning Sonic, no new sound effects or anything. But, but it still does look nice. It still does look nice. This is a really nice reskin. Really nice. Really nice. Oh, there is new songs. Ooh, they they added music. Nice. So it looks like they went all out with the music. I like how they uh, changed the music and stuff, so it can be a little bit more unique of a mod. It's not just a reskin. They changed the the title screens and the menu screens and in the music as well oh there's a super form too nice 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 uh, i don't really read the comics or anything like that but i know scourge has a super form and i'm happy they added added that into this mod this is clean so this is really nice even he's, he's even flying he has a different like idol animation playable metal sonic shadow the hedgehog blaze the cat silver the hedgehog awesome sonic sprites and that's in all one Sonic Mania Plus mod. What? Plus, show these, show these creators love. I don't know if these are the creators or not, but if you've ever come across one of the creators of these mods, then just give them some love. Like, just give them a like. You know, tell them that you you appreciate their work because like they're actually out here tr trying to get somewhere with these mods. You know, they're working hard on these mods. I know. I don't know. I never made a mod before, so I, I won't fully know. But I, I assume these mods are really hard to make. So. I, I just really appreciate, I appreciate these people coming out, out out here and giving Sonic fans extra things to look forward to in the Sonic games in the Sonic community. The middle song looks nice, you know, fitting stage. I like his running animation. He's flying and his his dash, his fast running is uh um, like he has fire around him. It's just really cool. Mephiles is going to be the boss fight for this. He has sound effects too. That's nice. So Mephiles is the boss fight for this. That's cool. It has new music too. It's not the you know it's obviously not the regular music. So that's cool. They have Mephiles as a boss fight. What is this? Oh, they is that the gun truck? <laughs> they, have, they have they got the gun truck in here. We got Blaze. Blaze looks clean. Oh, they have they have um, Mecha Sonic. Ooh ooh. Silver, ooh, I like I, I like Silver. Silver's my favorite Sonic character because of his abilities. Ooh, they got music too. I think it's from Sonic and Silver Ring. Yeah, but Silver looks clean. He has, a, it, it looks like it's Ray. Um, silver skinned over. 
because it looks like uh, he's doing the little glide move that Ray has. But that's cool because Silver can fly, obviously, so it's, that's a nice touch. And he has the little aura around him when he flies. He has the adventure pose. That's nice. I like that. I like that. Really good attention to detail. Shadow. Let's see. Let's see what Shadow has. Ooh, he, ooh he's uh, kind of gliding when he falls down. I like that. That's a good cat. I like his skating animation, too. Here's a Sonic the Movie render from uh, NR03. It looks clean. This is a fan made render. This looks, oh, this looks official, honestly. Like, this is a really nice render. I like the ring and the phone. It looks really nice. I like the, it kind of, you can see the light from the phone uh, light up his face and the, the glove right there. Get that like. Decide to render Sonic drifting. This is from Sir Guy Gus. I'm sorry if I say, <laughs> if I say your name wrong. No, I like Sonic renders. I use, I use renders in my thumbnails again. And I, I like a good render. This is a really nice render. But Sonic renders have been getting so much better <laughs> in the past years because Sonic renders are always good But like they've been getting a lot higher quality and a lot better looking like the renders I honestly I've to be 100% honest I feel like the renders that fans make are better than the official renders that Sega releases yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be 100% honest and, that, and that's good for that's good for Sega and the fans because Now Sega knows that they have really nice fans. They really have talented fans that can really make really high quality art and stuff like this this is really nice I, it's really high quality have i ever seen a render of sonic drifting before i probably have but i, I don't remember oh, this is cool i like this it's nice and simple you have the nice class of sonic pose but it's modern sonic the at it's right there sleepy art go follow this person really nice render really nice render a bit of warming up from uh azri hyper Azri, I think that's how you say your name. Sorry, but it looks like he's in the process of making a render, and it looks complicated. I, don't, I, I see. I've never thought of making renders, but I, seeing as I probably will never try to do it because it looks like it requires some real, real precise, like placing. Because like I feel like if you move it, if you move a part of the finger to a little bit, a little bit off, it's gonna look weird. So it looks like it requires some pre precise movements or whatever i don't know <laughs> but i mean this is nice i like this i mean it's not polished obviously but rendering render i feel like making renders isn't easy yeah <laughs> i got a nice super smash bros sonic render remake kind of little thing i like the lighting i feel the lighting is better in this one than it is in the official one from from uh the smash from smash bros and the render is made from hypersonic 172 on deviantart all right, I think that's going to cap it off. Sonic fans are over overly talented. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to leave a like, subscribe if you are new to the channel, and I'll see y'all in the next one.